So we are at our hotel now. We are at La Meridian in Fort Lauderdale. And we're almost to our room. Let's go check this out. Uh, sorry, we're closed. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Come on in. Jason is going to be such a happy boy in the morning. There's espresso. Check out the bathroom. You're really going to like the shower. What? Look here. I can... Oh. <laughs> Man, that glass is so clean, I about broke my nose. <laughs> How, do you get this? How do you get in this thing? Okay. That was really funny. What's this? No, it's less than I might use it. Yeah, this is a nice uh, hotel room. Very nice hotel. Oh yeah, crank that down. All right. More. More. So we're gonna get settled in, and then we have a group dinner tonight. So things are gonna be a little different. We are being hosted by the Fort Lauderdale Visitor and Convention Bureau for a few things. Um, and they are taking us to dinner tonight. So we will probably not vlog at dinner, but we'll give you a full review afterwards. So we haven't been to Fort Lauderdale. Oh, we're near the airport. The plane, <laughs> the plane, boss, the plane. <laughs> we haven't been to Fort Lauderdale since 1996. Yeah, for her, Elisa's. When I graduated trip. high school. So this is gonna be fun. Look at the size of this. Oh! Careful, they're not very heavy. <laughs> Look out. Can I can I put you in there? Yes. Can you I have a in? you have a no, don't try and actually get in, honey. <laughs> Are you actually gonna get in the bird cage? Oh my gosh. Okay. Sorry, you gotta take a picture of this. I've never seen uh, chairs like this where you can just lay down and go to sleep right here in the lobby. Look at this couch. This is the longest couch I've ever seen. All right, time to get on the bus. We're going to start the tour, right? Yes, we are. All right. All right, so we got a little gift bag, huh? All right, so in, in our handy dandy tote bag, we have a visitor's map of Fort Lauderdale. A luggage bag that says, Hello, Sunny. Greater Fort Lauderdale. And a smart wallet. Cool. And our itinerary for the next couple days. So tonight, we are going to the Hyatt Place near the cruise port for welcome refreshments. We are going to Riverside Hotel. Oh, you got the horn. Oh, it's like a nice hotel. Sure, hotel hopping. Or hotel hopping. Yogurt, cereals, baked goods, toast, juices. You should stay here just for the cookies, right? <laughs> stay here for the cookies. I like to think of this Hyatt Place, which is the title is Hyatt Place Fort Lauderdale Cruise Port, as the cruise port hotel in the city. Um, one, because of our location, just blocks to the port, but also that we have an airport shuttle, which gets you here in about five or 10 minutes. Um, and you probably know that because you're at the Labor Meridian, which is at the airport, and you got here in what, five minutes maybe tonight? And so that's how close we are. And then the port is right down this way, and it's only a few blocks, and we also have the cruise port shuttle. That is fee-based, it is $7 to get per person. But when everyone's together, mm -hmm. it's, the, it's the better option. Everyone gets to get on this Absolutely. shuttle van and all the luggage fields. Everyone gets there to go as a group. So you have a city, a downtown city view of Fort Lauderdale. Very nice.
Oh. Okay, test of oh. a big room. The spin you can test. Spin in it. It's a big room. It's a big room. Oh. <laughs> So this hotel has rooms that have a king bed or rooms with two double beds reason, and this sofa makes into a sleeper. So this room with the king will sleep four. That last room we're in sleeps six. Rates as low as 129 a night with breakfast, with Wi-Fi. That's pretty darn good. The size of these rooms are ridiculous. Every room's a suite. Very affordable. Um, I mean, you can sleep up to six people. This is pretty cool. And I'm enjoying JV's hotel. The view is excellent. You got a great city view. So you have to ask for a northern facing room. That's the ticket. To get the city view. That's right. So that's the ticket, kids. Make sure you do that. Feels great outside. Look at this. So this is the Riverside Hotel. It was built in 1936. So part of this hotel is old and original and some of it is new. So we're heading to the Executive Tower now. taco shells but I bet with the taco shells it's even better but the filling is great this is the most beautiful presentation I think I've ever seen at a restaurant look at this place this is the catch of the day which is sea bass with heirloom tomatoes sliced mango blackberry sauce and I got the tenderloin eight ounce tenderloin so my eight ounce tenderloin is cooked perfectly, medium rare, just the way I like it. Cheers. So tonight was interesting. We went, we're, we saw this hotel that we're staying at, plus two others, the Hyatt Place and the Riverside. Um, three very different hotels. So the cool thing about doing this is we're seeing all these different hotels all in Fort Lauderdale so we can tell what's right you know for what people so like the hyatt's really good for families this one's more modern uh the riverside was more it was old and eclectic but had really good locations so i mean everything's a little bit different but this was actually a lot more enjoyable than i thought it would be we really enjoyed ourselves tonight and good food Good morning, honey. Good morning. Welcome to Fort Lauderdale. Day two. We're day one full day. Had uh, some espresso. That coffee pot was pretty cool. <laughs> it's good coffee. Uh, we're waiting to meet up with the group this morning and then we're going to run off to another hotel and have some breakfast and do some more hotel tours for, for the day. Yep. Along with a couple other things. Yep. Okay, so we are at the Renaissance Hotel this morning. First tour of the day.
Font cruise ships. Yeah, one princess, one carnival. So we just finished touring the Renaissance Hotel. This hotel is across the street from the cruise port. So literally you can look out the window and see cruise ships right there in the harbor, which is really cool. Yeah, which we saw three of four right now. Yeah, so great location. Um, also you can walk out the back gate and there's a Walgreens across the street. So if you need to pick anything up right before you go on your cruise. So good location, very nice hotel, beautiful pool. Beautiful pool, beautiful hotel. Very convenient location. All these hotels that we've seen so far will do the job. They're all great, just a matter of preference and taste. Yep. yep. the High Tides Pool Bar and Pool Area. So we have been touring the Bahia Mar Hotel which is right here on Fort Lauderdale Beach. It's my favorite. It's, yeah, well, I mean, we're beach people. So, so we're learning. Each hotel has something different to offer. This one is beach location. So you're on the beach. Literally, there is a skywalk where you can leave the hotel, walk across the highway straight to the beach. Yeah. It's amazing. You know, we were just showing you the skywalks to the pool and to different wings of yeah. this hotel. It's just a neat experience. It's something that you're not, you don't see every time. Right. So it's really cool. And then it's close to the beach. Yes. We just had some food here. The food was pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, the location is even better. Um, and it's just a neat, neat hotel. The rooms are good. I love the um, atmosphere. So all in all, really cool place to stay if you're down this way and you hopping on a cruise ship and you need to stay a couple of days. Absolutely. Definitely a good spot for you to come stay. Yep. We've really enjoyed our, I mean, we've been here for a few hours and just walking around the hotel, having some lunch. It's been very enjoyable. We've been hotel hopping. We are hotel hopping. There's the Skyway. Right there. See it? All the people walking. Well, yeah, there's so no people walking right now. There's the hub right here. So from here you go into the hotel or into the old hotel or this will take you to the pool. Yeah. And then the other walkway will take you to the beach. Now we are going to the Everglades. Going on an airboat ride. You want to go on a boat ride with the bunch, old man? <laughs> Just don't make no business to me. <laughs> 